Welcome once again to our game talk. This time we're talking about L. What was it? Uh, PT. PT. I was about to say LT. Yeah, LT. LT. <laughs> we're talking about PT, PT, a new horror indie demo for uh, the intro to uh, Silent Hills. Oh. That's uh, Hills with an S. Featuring Daryl from Walking Dead. Yeah, Norman Reedus is actually going to be part of this game. Uh, Hideo Kojima and uh, Guillermo del Toro are the ones who are uh, actually Ooh, behind the scenes. Yeah, fan, fancy, really, fancy, yeah. the roll of the tongue, I guess. Guillermo del Toro. <laughs> <laughs> um, I played the demo and scared shit out of me. I played the demo and I just lost my mind because I was like, where am I going now? It's just you, basically Inception, but you, it's you good. You go though. into it and you're already kind of freaked out. It's an endless hall way that every time you go through the hallway it slightly changes but it still seems the same and then there are certain events that happen that you have to uh, uh piece together one by one different yeah. and different and every time you go down the hallway there's definitely a different uh sequence of events happening pictures stuff and just seeing the strangest things you've ever seen before. And then jump scares, which that's when I was like, oh, time to turn this off and go home to my bed <laughs> and sleep this off. The jump scares were, I'll say, one of the best things about the game was the jump scares and just different kind of things happening around you. Like every second thing was happening new around you. So what do you think is going to be the big thing for this game? The big thing about it is it's just basically as an intro to Walking Dead, the new not Walking Dead, uh, excuse me, to uh, Silent Hills. Yeah, it's hard to say not to say Walking Dead because it's Daryl and it's Daryl from Walking yes. Dead. Yes. So, um, I'm I'm thinking it's gonna be really good. Apparently, uh, Hideo Kojima said that he's building this game to literally scare the crap out of you, and if it and if you can't handle it, don't play it. I know there's another game coming out called Until Dawn, which is going to be a good one, a good jump scare as well. So I hope this actually overdo, overdo. Uh, so I hope this Silent Hills overdo. Well, Until, Until Dawn. Dawn, I think is uh is it since it's going to be an indie title, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, but also going to be a uh, like you know how you played Heavenly Rain. Yeah, it's going to be like this like different uh side effects to what you do ah so okay. it's like if you do something wrong, something else happens. Is there different ways of people dying and living? Okay. So in Silent Hills is going to be top for me because it's Daryl Walking Dead. Yeah, it's Walking Dead. It looks Darryl. really good. At the end of the demo, it shows uh, it shows off a little trailer with uh, showing the face of Norma Reedus, uh, and I just got to say it, it, it looks awesome. It does look awesome. Said and it will scare the pants off you for most people. Well, for me anyway, it scared the pants off. I'm gonna you. play with him so he both can have a good I'm time not in the dark. Playing that game again. If we were playing this game in the dark, no. With the rest of us playing this game in the dark, I'll play it with people around if they're playing it. I, I'm not a horror game person, you know this. I am. I love all horror games and horror movies. Yeah. Uh, so we'll we will be playing it, and you gotta be seeing the side effects and facial expressions. So. Uh, what do you think? Uh, what do you think the game's going to be about? Well, besides Silent Hill, it's. I think the game's going to try to go back to the roots. How the beginning of Silent Hill started It's basically mm -hmm. how you end up in a small town and you're just trying to find secrets about your daughter, or something like that. I hope it's something like that, but maybe a little bit different without well, finding the daughter. The one big thing about Silent Hill was the fact that each each person that goes to Silent Hill, or, or, what what supposed to happen, each person that goes to Silent Hill. They experience Silent Hill in their own My, way, oh, wow. uh, because they whatever they're going through. Like uh, the biggest one they did this with was um, Silent Hill Two. They had it where James, I think his name James Sunderland, I think that was the main character. For mm -hmm. He uh, he actually had uh, had it where a lot of his stuff he was he was struggling with uh, the fact that he was uh, that his wife was dead. So he had a lot of stuff dealing with. Women, especially uh, his wife, a uh, uh, lady who looks like his wife appearing in there, dealing with his uh, feeling like impotent and stuff like that since his wife was, uh, since his wife's passing and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. that was Pyramid Head. Oh, and, Pyramid Head was a great ad. And one thing that they've been doing with the, with the whole uh, Silent Hill thing is they've been putting too much mir uh, uh, Pyramid Head into it. Because Pyramid Way Head was a fan's favorite. When he first introduced Pyramid Head, everyone was just in love with Pyramid Head. Yeah. But you are is kind of like overdoing it with Pyramid Head so much. It's like, we know who he is. We know he's a badass. He doesn't ass. fit in every story. That's yeah. the thing. They just put him up there. Oh, Silent Hill. But gotta put in Pyramid Head. Um, well, with this one, I'm hoping that they actually have a story that tells 
why this particular character is in Silent Hill and has monsters that that kind of sort of uh, coincide with the story. What are you trying to say, Daryl's nightmares are zombies? <laughs> oh, I, I don't. If God, if they do zombies, I'm really disappointed. <laughs> Just a smidgen disappointed because that. that come on, man. Hey, apparently, uh, he is a big horror fan. So that's yes, why he does, is. That's why he's doing this. And I'm glad he is because there's no one else that's better than Norman Reedus right now. Yeah, really, he's, he's a he's really big still. Yeah, really oh yeah, big. Oh yeah, he's really big. And I'm I'm really interested to see whether they're, how they're gonna go with this. Um, the, they don't have an official release date for it. I don't believe they don't. It's still a uh, trailer right now. It's still in process, going through built, being built. Still trying to get a little finishing touches to it. But we will surprise. I'm giving it probably till the next year of summer or, or in the winter time. I'm thinking the end of next year. Probably like about, around October, Halloween yeah, time. Yeah, about quarter three, quarter four. I yeah, I'm saying. Uh, it. It just seems like it's gonna scare the pants off of people, and I don't want to be scared. And we are all playing I'm, it together. I'm not playing <laughs> this game. All four of us in this group is gonna play the game in the dark that night. We're gonna get we're gonna play together. Okay, I, as long as I have somebody to. Then, then, then we play. You gonna be my cuddle buddy? I don't know yet. <laughs> 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 but we all well, we're actually gonna do this. It'll be better. We're all gonna play it one by one. You all gonna get a little no, smidge. No, yes. Screw that. We're all gonna be in another room. And y'all gonna play. We're gonna play it one by one in the dark by ourselves. I love ourselves. how you deciding all this when I'm. I love horror no. movies. I love horror yeah, games. Then why don't you play the game? I will we'll play. Watch. You know okay, I will. Then we'll watch. Out. Okay. I'll still play. I'll have fun with it. All right, then. <laughs> I'll watch you play this scary ass game that's gonna be coming out soon. Uh, just wanna give a shout out to Hideo Kojima. About time they let you play or play around with some other title besides Metal Gear. Uh, I was kind of hoping that it would be Zone of the Enders, but Silent Hills is not bad. Not bad at all. And I'm hoping this is going to be a good adding to the franchise of the Silent Hill. And so, my shout out goes out to CeCe. What up? Man, that's wrap, wrap it up, isn't it? Yeah, that basically wraps up uh, Talk About PT. Uh, thank you for watching. King Legacy out. <laughs> Because video games. Best kept secret. <laughs>